deer on the Missouri River. Uh, I haven't fished out here yet, but we've uh, been told it's pretty good for uh, going for walleyes. I'm just sure gonna put our odds. I'm gonna try, uh, probably gonna try this gold buckshot spoon I've got sitting in here. No, I'll probably go with the yellow and orange actually. I got a mask going on. Show you here. I'm gonna dangle that right away. Uh, yeah, I think we're fishing 25, 30 foot of water. And hopefully we can get on a few. And yeah, stay tuned. First one, first walleye this year. Just came out, getting after it today. Pretty good one. The guy standing up in the gray. Brandon. Yeah. Are most of them up, suspended at like 20 foot? No. Down towards the bottom? Mine came off the bottom. Oh. Oh, here comes one. Yep, there's one. Yep. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You don't feel huge, but... You don't want to lose anything, right? We got it, we got it going. Alright, we're going to go ahead and get it. There you go. Came right up on the bottom. I know, right? They smell good. There you go. That's my first fish of the day, folks. We got three on the ice now. Me, Jalen, and Brennan now hooked up, so. Uh, nothing crazy in size yet, about 15 inches, so. We got a couple, couple to go yet before the end of the day. Um, we're hoping it picks up right here at dark. I don't know, we'll have to see how it goes out here on the Missouri River. 
We're gonna hook him right behind the dorsal fin. So that way he tips on like that. He's in there. A little bit of finesse. Bobber stop got messed up, so it's right at the end of the pole, so it's going to take a little bit to get down there, but no big deal. Let's go. I make it count, baby. I make it count. Don't let it, don't lose it. Oh my god, I hope you have a string. I hope you have a needle on this one. What? Check them out. Pull them up. That right there is nice. South Dakota. Missouri River walleye. Doesn't get much better than that. One fish. That's all I needed. Another right. dandy. Oh. <laughs> Ease. Third one, Taylor just hooked on with a real nice fish. I came up, had another one come up. Doing pretty well, starting to pick up right now. So. Yeah. Where are those minnows at? What's that? What? Oh, I thought you said something. Well, boys, it is 6:23. Haven't caught a fish in a couple minutes, so there's people heading out right now. We're gonna stick at it. We got Jalen in the shack. Taylor is actually going up shallow to see if he can get something up there. Maybe the fish rolled up shallow now that it's getting late, getting dark out. Um, Brennan's still grinding out a hole he's been on for the last 30 minutes or so. So. Um, I don't know, I'm just gonna move around a little bit. If Taylor's market will shallow, I'll go up there. Dylan, Dylan hasn't caught anything, so, I don't know. That's a wrap. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hey.
Hey, is there a food up there? Yeah. Uh, well, folks, we just got finished up. What time is it? You got your phone on you? Yeah. 6.52. About 7 o'clock. We just got done. We finished up with about, I think we got nine fish, right? Yeah, nine. Nine keepers, which everything is keeper. We got about pretty much all 14, 15 inches. Taylor got a good yep. 19 incher. So we're, we plan on coming out tomorrow again. Yep. <sighs> Hopefully we can get on some bigger fish, but right. I mean, you, you can't complain about yeah. 14 inches. I mean, could have came out here and not caught anything. Right, but. weather was nice. It was a little yeah. breezy. Yeah, about had our shack blow away at the end. Yeah, that was scary. <laughs> old Jalen. Oh, Jalen. But other than that, we're gonna wrap it up, head back back home tonight. We'll be back out here tomorrow.